Well, in tonight's Unsolved California, a case more than 20 years old now and unsolved. Who killed Heather Leanne Hibbs? We dug through our archives to revisit this case, and Solano County detectives are hoping a $50,000 reward will bring answers. This was a very gruesome, very brutal, very horrible crime that can't go un unnoticed. Um, Heather just can't be forgotten. 20 years have passed since the body of Heather Lee Ann Hibbs was found right here in a remote part of Solano County. It didn't look real. It didn't look real. A rancher discovered Hibbs's body on February 10th, 2002 in an irrigation canal near the intersection of Brown and Salem Roads east of Vacaville. I can see it. I still see it all the time. The discovery came as heartbreaking news. Her family, who reported her missing January 29th, was holding on to hope she was alive. Detectives say she was seen in San Francisco around January 11th and shortly after was seen at the Solano Mall in Fairfield, leaving with someone in a blue truck. Several months after the discovery, detectives held a news conference to announce a $50,000 reward. That still stands. We're at a stalemate. Heather's mother, Wendy Burton, keeping her daughter's case alive throughout the years. This has been an up and down siege every day of my life, um, wondering why this is not a priority. Unfortunately, if someone can do this kind of horrendous crime, they can do it again. And now Solano County Sheriff detectives resurfacing her case on Facebook. Who killed Heather Hibbs? I'm not going anywhere and I'm not leaving until this is solved. I'm just not.